what's up guys welcome back to the channel I am trip HP junkie and on this channel if you're new to the channel all we do is Harley Davidson related products installs rides demos stuff like that so um, today we have a kind of just a maintenance video um, what's going on I'm doing a couple things to Betty I wanted to show you on and then we're gonna wash the Dyna I'm gonna show you what it takes to detail the Dyna that's my daily driver it seems like this year um, because of COVID traffic has been down in Nashville so I've been riding every chance I get as long as the weather's cooperating but uh, this year's been pretty good so um, yeah we'll show you to uh, to detail the bike and we're gonna also try some F11 at the end of it I'm gonna apply a coat of uh, the F11 ceramic coating at the end and work that in and get my first initial thoughts and everything on the product so let's go check out betty what we're doing to betty i wanted to do something to kind of revive her and what we did is we took off these spotlights and it looks a lot more like a street glide uh, i think it looks a lot better like this so we're waiting on a uh, cable for the amp um, so i can get the stereo going again and and all that stuff and yeah we're gonna do some ride videos on that um, give my first and thought impressions of these legends uh, suspension the axio fronts and the and the rears on this guy so but yeah I think it cleans it up a lot um, hopefully getting all this weight off the front end would actually help the handling some but I kind of dig the styling I think it looks stripped down and mean so <laughs> but yeah let's uh, Hop on the Dyna and run down to the car wash and get that thing washed. Oh, first thing first here, uh, before we get down there, I normally just run the, the wash and wax uh, stuff that they have at Advanced Auto Parts. Any Meguiar's or any good name brand washes is, is gonna be a good wash to use. And this is our left F11 uh, top coat. And what it is a ceramic coating. It's supposed to act like a uh, second skin or a, basically like a, um, clear coat that you can apply like a wax to protect it so uh, we'll give our first impressions on that F11 top coat once we get her washed up so let's head down to the car wash So we got it all washed up and dried off. Um, I hope you could tell from the last time lapse that we did is that what I've been taught is always start at the top and then wash down. And then I normally do it two or three more times because bikes are small. So you can get them cleaned up, you know, relatively quick and not to spend a bunch of time. But yeah, I wanted to use these lights to kind of give you the condition the paint's in now. It's kind of a reference. We'll use this tank for that uh, F11. But yeah, it's been waxed one time, I believe. Um, other than that, it's just been normal washes. So let's apply this F11 and see what we got afterwards. So 
So first impressions of the F11 top coat. Um, if you put it on too thick, it will run. Um, and then you gotta use a clean rock cloth to, uh, to clean it all up. But um, just put a very light misting on it. And I think it shined it up pretty good. There's still some, there's still some hazing. Uh, there's some lines in there, but I think it'll just get better over time. We'll see how this stuff holds up. Um, if not, I got some other ones to try and we'll see. So we'll see how clean it can stay with just that coating. It, it, it looks pretty good on the fairing and the tank uh, looks really good. So. So we'll see. First impressions is I like it. The surface is really smooth, um, almost like it's been waxed. And of course, it's just a spray on, spray off, it's a spray on, spray, off. spray on, wipe off system from F11. So, uh, so far impressed. Really like their stuff. Not sponsored by them at all. Paid full retail for the stuff, but we'll give it a shot and see what it does. It's if it's better than waxing, it's better than waxing. So. so we appreciate it, guys. If you enjoyed this content, hit subscribe, hit the bell notification. We'll get you emailed notification when we upload a video. So appreciate the support, guys. Take it easy, and we'll see you on the next one.